and Tristan's parents and to her parents. I don't know why I say that now incorrectly. Hello friends, how are you? I hope everyone's having a great day and a blessed day so far. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about my experience, a couple of things with an armpit. I know, what? <laughs> Why do I decide to talk about this? So it's a lot of things that I have learned through the years and I wasn't aware at all what's going on with my body and all that. I know that a lot of people will say like everything is toxic and some things can be toxic but I will gonna be talking about my experience. I'm not an expert or anything about it. I'm not against medicine. I am not so I want to be making that disclaimer here so probably you guys can feel like I have some allergies uh, I'm not sick or anything okay I just have some allergies and my eyes have been crying and sometimes I feel like my nose is not cooperated with me so like that make it clear and yeah we're just having some allergies the weather here is a little crazy so today I also have this top so you know I'm gonna be showing my armpits but it's okay <laughs> me so before I get started go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you have any comment or prayer requests and leave it down below I would love to pray for you and gather our together for in Christ so I'm gonna be showing you what I have done and what I use sometimes for me but I'm gonna be linking um some things that I have found and what I have learned through the years um so let me go ahead and read right here because hello I found this in what was the one met live natural live something it was like medline.com so I tried to be like that source be very informative so Natural deodorants. What the natural deodorants are made with natural ingredients, example coconut oil or alcohol. So it's just to stop the bacteria from growing, but it's not going to be stopping sweat, okay? So not bacteria growing, but just still sweating. You're going to be sweaty. And I think that's totally normal because our bodies get all that fluid out and all that, okay? So. <laughs> yeah we will do that um so also you can be using something very absorbent absorbent that it came with it like baking soda baking powder uh, bamboo cornstarch and zinc so this will stop they will not still stopping the sweating it's just gonna help you to keep the area not smelling as much that's pretty much what it does no smell but just still sweating makes sense okay so the aluminium deodorants what is the difference so the deodorants deoritize probably i say that correctly i'm not sure so it smell <laughs> better because that's what is for um the anti transparent makes stop your sweat so you're not sweating with the anti transparent So the aluminium isn't like founding in deodorants, mostly in anti transparent unless they're mixed with both. So that's pretty much what we get in the stores. Like people, everyone talking about it. So in the stores, you get the anti transparent It's to stop sweating. So it's blocking your pores and clogging all of that. That's why it does, so you're not sweat. Um, and that's what I use the aluminium. So why the aluminium in and it's a anti-transparent. So, like I will say, they help you to clog your pores. So they're gonna be plugging your pores in your armpits so you don't sweat. Also, it's called aluminium chloroxide, so it's like salt that dissolves into your body. So it melts to the skin and only doctors and dermatologists can recommend it. So they can give you a prescription for that. So they do have some that are very, very different from the ones that you can find in the store. So the doctors will recommend you one and they give you a prescription because you do have that. 
prescription for you. Now what else I'm going to find in Target probably they have a little bit of aluminium is not, I don't think will be like very very bad but also not in a good thing. So my experience with that was this is my armpit so I don't know if you guys can see it looks pretty clean like not that dark but a long time ago this was very very dark wasn't very dark but it was dark and my hairs are not in the black side but they are darker so like very brown dark brown and you can see my hair is coming through you know like a lot of people probably didn't have too much hair but i do um pretty hairy like in my legs and in my armpits um pretty hairy i don't have too much hair in my hands which is very funny to me like here i do have hair okay i do have hair it's just very blonde technically like nothing but they're right here i have hair okay i do have hair i don't shave my arms or anything but my legs and my armpits mm, they are dark they are very very dark i don't know why but when I was younger, so I did sports, I was doing ballet and all of that. And I was very sweaty and I got a little stinky. <laughs> Hello, I was younger doing sports. I think everyone have to sweat, but some people are a little bit more stinky than others. And I was, I wasn't that stinky. I was in the middle of stinky. They do have the ones that don't stink. They do have the middle ones stinky ones and i do have these ones that are like dude i can't not be near you because you are very smell and it's very strong i am in the middle so no judgment to everyone because a lot of people would do so i'm just putting myself out there and taking you and sharing my experience so you will know what's going on so a lot of people tend not to have smell a little smell and the ones that you can smell it from far away you need to be near me so like hidden here and probably if i do this you can smell if i don't have the other end otherwise you will not notice because i always wear perfume but sometimes you can smell someone from the corner and you will be like Whoa, I'm not shaming or anything because like I said, everyone, it's very, very different. So, what I have done in the years, I was using the secret one, I have used the dope one, I have used all of them. They never stop sweating, but also was helping a little bit with the smell, but it wasn't. So, I still smell it because I was doing sports. So, when I was about 20 something years old i'm not gonna say how old i am <laughs> but when i was like there <laughs> in the 20s i noticed that my armpits was getting darker and i was like well i'm getting darker and and still nothing was going on and i was like huh i don't like this the other one honestly and that always is like the Y cast and all that and i was like what is going on? I tried the rolls. I did not like those. I have seen a lot of people who have used it and they love it. I honestly don't like it. I don't like the roll ones. I always like more like the ones that came in the stick for some reason. But I didn't like the white cast that left here. It's still very sweaty and sometimes I put it in there and I feel like it wasn't working. But my armpits it was getting darker and I was like that's my hair or what I thought the whole time it was my hair because my hair like I said is very very dark but now you guys can see it's not that dark anymore so when I was in Colorado I think that was in 2017 in 2017 I'm um, start exploring and changing to a natural deodorant and let me tell you when I did the natural deodorant, I went to Lush and get some of the bar deodorant. I got, I always love the natu natural things because like as I was saying in another video, I do have allergies in my skin. So I tried to keep that away. I used some cream, but it took me many years to use one cream that really helps my 
body because I kind of use Victoria's Secret or I kind of use Bath and Body Works like a lot of people do. I kind of use Neutrogena. I cannot use many ones because my skin gets very, very bumpy. So I have found one, uh, one of them and I love the Bum Bum Cream. It's having one that really has helped me with uh, my skin. And it's like one of my favorites. It smells really good. I know probably will be like, girl, you say no, but that's gonna have perfume. I don't know what is the ingredients difference, but I love that one. It lifts my skin very, very soft. And yeah, so <laughs> let me cut that part in there, but <laughs> you get what I'm saying. So I was learning in that. So what I was doing, it was like, okay, so I want to change and I started changing the deodorant to more natural. The first couple of times, I feel like I was not using deodorant at all. I was very sweaty. I was very stinky. And probably, like I said, people that it wasn't that near me didn't feel it. But I was feeling it. Like, it smells like as a dude in here and was me you know I, I know my smell it's I'm not trying to be rude or anything but I was like a little smelly and then I start looking online so I only saw Amanda Engsing I believe that's her name um she's like a makeup guru or makeup that's like her channel is about and she was talking about that and I was like oh, someone who is having kind of the same struggle so she recommend this detox and honestly I did not know what to do I have no idea that you need to detox your body I was more than a month and when I was googling all that they said it will only take 30 days depending of all that but I still very stinky and all that I was like hmm I think I'm gonna be switching back to a regular deodorant because these ones are not holding. I have speak with a lot of friends that I'm trying to switch to and they say the same thing. I feel this is not working. This is like very smelly, all of that. So I'm gonna be sharing what I have done. So she recommended this guy. I got in an Ulta is the, is the Healthy Underarm Detox Mask. You leave it for five minutes, just put it on after you shave or the next day or whatever. And just leave it in both of them for five minutes. And this have helped me to not smell. I have been done like a couple of times for years now. And sometimes once a month I do this because I feel that it's still a little stinky, which I guess is totally normal. Or probably I eat something and I shouldn't used to be. So this, I have been using this mask for the longest time since 2017. That's when I was changing to my natural deodorant. And let me tell you, it got me after a half baby. I don't know also if it, when I was pregnant, my hormones, my hormones was a little crazy. So <laughs> it was, you know, and I was working and I was sweating and all of that and it was very hot in Colorado so I don't know it's and it was very dry too I don't know if it, that was a factor that it wasn't helping me at all with my journey but I keep pushing through it and let me tell you it's working so I have used this mask which I love I totally recommend I have no idea that we need to detox they do have another one so this is around $26 I believe maybe I don't know because a lot of things are going up in prices but yeah it's very very good and I have you it to use it so I have this guy right so this guy you know he uses it to take a shower and all that do your bad because sometimes our arms I don't get there what I do I put some soap and I put it in my armpit and I start scrubbing I do it pretty much every single day and let me tell you it feels so good in your arm it feels very very clean so once a day it's like scrubbing your arms because you're not gonna do it all the time but these hairs right here I don't know what it is but they are amazing to clean a new underarm okay I totally recommend these 
I don't think they do have one like small, you know, for this area. So I just have this guy in. Uh -uh -uh, uh -uh, do that all the time, which hey, I love. I do it this for like two minutes, you know, and I don't wear the other one for that night, honestly. And the next day, I don't smell. I don't know if this is like penetrates or something, and just clean that in there, but it's so good. Other thing I have been using, so I got these Pacifica on the on the other one wipes. So this brand also have some of the scrub. I have not using. I only have used these wipes. So I had some of the other, but I'm just going to show you what I do. So I carry this one with me, or when I'm at home. So these are the other one. They are outdoor neutral sensor with coconut milk and pineapple. Let me tell you, it smells so good. This wipe is just very, very simple. So just gonna open one and just gonna wipe. Let me show you like that because oh, it smells very, very nice. I know this looks a little gross, but it feels like the other end. But you just need to go, not just in one, you know, you need to take everything. Boom. There you go. Nothing. This feels very fresh. Just in case if you're on the go and you need like a little refresher and you don't want to wear your deodorant or you don't want to carry with you your deodorant because it's like a little more compact. You know? So just like it wipes. Can we kind of like go into the bathroom wipes where they are not bathroom wipes, okay? This is deodorant for your underarm. So, those ones are very good. I have been using for the longest time. And like I said, just wipe and it feels a little fresh. You don't feel that sweaty. I have been using this guy and honestly, it works, um, which I love. So, also, I got this in Florida a long, long time ago. This is for your body. So, when you go camping, when my husband needs to go for a couple of days, and he needs to take a shower or something that I even have shower or anything. This is what we use. So this is like lift away the dirt and texture inside for the smooth spots and finish and fresh finish. Uh, this is like mostly water. So you know if you go to camping or something and it is nothing to take a shower, you can use this also down there and for your whole body. You know, like yeah. I got this in Florida in 2019 and i'm very glad i got a couple of bags of these it's been very very hard for me to find these bags again but this is very very good so do the other ones i have used i have used a lot of them like i was saying the bar i have used another ones there are from a local store in colorado um it was like baking soda all that I have been using some from Ulta, like um, a pink, like kind of, I don't know what is the name. I will try to put them somewhere to show you what is the one. But I have been using this Capari for the longest time and I got with this uh, new one, uh, Drunk Elephant. And I have to say, Drunk Elephant, it's been one of my favorites with the Capari. I have this too. I purchased this two at the same time with this guy. So this two have been using after baby and hot work for me. No smell or anything. It's coconut oil. It's like my favorite ones. And then I got this guy. And between both of us here, you know, we're talking and both of these. I think we prefer this one a little bit better. Be quite honest, I noticed with this one it feels so good, so smooth, so it feels very, very nice. So this is the Capari. It looks a little bit uh, like brownish color. I'm not going to open it because it's brand new. Um, but yeah, this is the Trunk Elephant one and this is how it looks like. And then um, it's like a cream. So. If I move this guy, it's gonna come like some little creams. It's not like this one that it's like a, a bar. 
you, you know what I'm talking about? I don't know how to explain it. This is like more as a cream and just a little bit go a long way. So it's like four, like four dots in here and you just need to roll here on top. I have no idea if they came with a lot. So it's like two ounces and I have this for like two months and I'll wear it all the time. It's still working wonders. So with this one, some just I can go up also like two, three months, depending. I don't know. I really don't need much deodorant, to be honest, because now after years and years to doing this, now is when working and I don't feel stinky or anything. I just need to do it one time. And if I feel like I'm to sweat, I have this guy right here. So this is pretty much what I have used, what I have done and my journey. Like I didn't know that we need to detox. And when I was detoxing my body, this part right here, it got a little lighter. Um, some people have done the turmeric with yogurt and rose water i believe so and put it in there and it helps with the color of the skin only thing i have used is having this one which i love i have not tried another one so probably i will try to do the other ones i just was reading the reviews and this one was one of the best it was a little in the price size um so yeah that's probably why because i was like very desperate but i like it so like i was saying at least once a month with this one so depending how you feel how's your body you need to learn your body and we need to go pushing through it and sometimes it can be or diet it can be that we have an issue when our body like hormones things like that i don't know we just need to go and try to figure it out what is work for us. I always try to eat pretty healthy, so I wasn't sure probably it's my hormones and after baby my husband's my hormones have been a little crazy, so everything changed or body changed through the years. So I'm just learning and this is what I have found that works for me. And like I said, this part right here with this echo tool, it was like five dollars. I don't even know I don't remember how much it was it was in sale they do have one of these and it's just like clean on there you will be fine you will be fine so one of these guys one of these guys one of these guys and you the aura that works for you just keep pushing through it detox your body you will notice a different documented I wish I can dump it can't documented all of this but hey i started 2017 now i just feel like mm, mm, mm. so i was talking with my friend and she told me you know like girl i just feel like it's not working for me and i told her this is what i use it this is what i did and that's pretty much it like sometimes we just need to do what we need to do but honestly i think natural deodorants are very good and only that they don't stop the sweat which is okay if it you sweat that's okay but hey for now have not smelly or anything it took me a couple of years it wasn't three weeks it wasn't a month it wasn't like it's six months or anything like other people it took me almost four years it but in the three year kind of mark because like i said i was pregnant with baby in 2019 so that year it was like working but the hormones was a little crazy so last year in 2020 was the one that i was like finally find did the elder run that works for me it was this guy and other things that i've been doing like i said diet things like that the perfume i love oils and put some cream also in your body trying to keep in the same area of smell so you don't have one smell and another perfume you know trying to keep in the same area smell or no smell at all and have just the perfume that's okay so that's what have worked for me so i don't get very smelly and i found last year that the capari was the word the worst for my body but now this have been my favorite 
I don't know what you have, but it's very good and I can use it almost all day. No application, no anything. And I'm still sweating, but not as much. And here in this state, I'm not sweat a lot. But now, summer, it's getting a little crazy. This, this weekend is going to be 100 or something. <laughs> that will be new for being here. But we'll see. But this guy has helped me to do that. So this is what I use. Keep pushing through, trying to look what it works for you, for your body. Clean in there and all that. Don't give up if you want to, but your armpits it's going to be very very happy and not that dark if you have that little uh tint to it like it happens to me it was a detox process and i guess i was having a lot because it took me longer than what i thought so everyone it's different so i hope this video was helpful and what i have done and what i have used over the years and now i'm fully natural deodorant and not stinky at all but still sweating okay there's the tea still sweating no stinky at all when i use it so i hope this video was helpful uh but yeah i will see you in my next video stay blessed have a good weekend and yeah do you have any plans let me know down in the comments bye guys <laughs>